Oh, that'd yeah. feel good to uh, see some shots fall. It's always helpful, right? <laughs> <laughs> it always helps when the ball goes in the hope <laughs> more than it doesn't, um, especially against a team as talented as, as these guys are. You just going to need it. Um, but remarkable job defensively, right, to hold them to 90 points. I think it's, it's quite something. Um, so we're just going to have to do it do it again. Uh, as hard as that is, um, that's going to that's gonna be our mindset uh, on our next game. Try to stop them, try to force them into tough shots, um, try to get Kevin and, and, and Clay to pass up some of the shots um, and, and continue to play with the confidence that we shot the ball um, and the rhythm, the poise that we shot the ball uh, with today. 6.34 left, the guys are five. What's the mindset of this team, you know, trying to close out a game before against them? Right. Well, you you got to focus on the next play, uh, and that's what we talked about in the in the timeout. Um, so forget about the run that they just made. Uh, it's about the next possession, and we got to score to cut that uh, run down and and come up with stops. You know, and that's what it's that's what it's about when it comes down to crunch time and uh, the game is on the line and you're trying to win it. you got to go take it. you got to make plays, and, and there's no way around it. When you saw that Aldridge bank three, did you just feel like, oh, this, thank this you. is ours to lose? <laughs> I was like, thank you. <laughs> thank, <laughs> thank God. Uh, it's one of those shots that uh, Hail Mary type of shot, right? Uh, just went up at the end of the possession and went in, which uh, we were happy about. How much did Danny's defense on play bother him? Oh, it's key, yeah. Um, just, just being on clay and uh, the way Danny can because of his length um, and physicality is very important. You got to stay attached to him. You can't relax. It's 24 seconds at all times, every possession. They look for him, they scream for him. Um, he constantly moves. So it's a very tough cover. And he doesn't need any airspace to get his shot up. And he's been shooting the ball extremely well until tonight or until today. And um, so we need him to have, again, another uh, lower percentage shooting night in order for us to, to have a chance because Kevin is also very, uh, very hard to stop no matter who you put, put him on. And it's, just, it's just very hard. Uh, the, the guy has tremendous skill set, very uh, length. He can shoot over anyone, even the seven-footers. Um, so, um, so you got your work cut out. But, but if we can keep play a little bit of rhythm and missing, that, that gives us a chance. Where's Mono with the energy? Play like he does. It's hard. I think hard. Uh, you know, you have it or you don't. Um, and players like Mono, they bring the competitiveness, the edge, the spirit, the, the pride. Um, and it's something that he's had all, all his career. Um, and he still brings it to, to the table to every single second that he's out there. And there's nothing is not no, nothing new, but it's remarkable that he has and continues to have that type of passion and competitive edge at this point of his career. And, um, and it's, you know, so I think it's something to commend him for, and, and something to be proud of as a team, as a teammate, as a fan of this team. Um, so that's that's mine. You saw Lamarcus' struggles last year, and for him to come back and, and do what he's been doing consistently. Mm -hmm. This season and another season of struggle for the team. Mm -hmm. uh, what does that say about his mental you know, toughness and mm -hmm. his desire to be great? Yeah, I think he stepped. Uh, he took a huge step forward this year uh, after two years where he tried to fit in, trying to find himself um, in, in this group, in this team after 10 years with, with Portland. Um, so I think he's had one of his best years in his career and, and now in a position of, of leadership amongst other great players. So uh, I think he's done great and it speaks highly of him, of his desire, uh, of his mindset going into the season um, and with all the adversity that we had uh, this year. Um, so I'm, I'm proud of him. I think he's uh, you know, had a heck of a year and, and hopefully he'll continue to have it. Dejounte, uh, they saved off him so much, and you finally made him pay. How yeah. was that in the first time? Very important. Uh, Dejounte, I think, has come in the last couple of days for this game and, and worked on his, on his shots and on his rhythm. And uh, I think tonight it showed. Uh, he came in and was ready to shoot it. He was not surprised by it. He was expecting it, and uh, he was ready to pull the trigger. And he shot the ball very well, made him pay, and opened up the game uh, for us. Uh, so. Um, so that was that was great to see, and and uh, we're going to need more of it the next game. Thank you, Powell, for you get you over here.